Hey guys, it's me, here, back at you guys with another comic book unboxing and review. And this is going to be interesting because these are both origin stories, and I just, or different takes on origin stories. And so I decided to unbox them. I'm getting about two more coming next week. And hopefully they're going to be awesome, which I am sure they will be. Because <laughs> these two are Fantastic Four and Spider-Man Season 1 hardcover. Like, they're both retellings of the origins of these characters and upcoming i have dr strange and daredevil season one they're both separate they, all these are separate books from what i've heard they're all really good uh, but i'm actually gonna put this off to the side because i have another topic i want to talk about this video has been pre uh, pre-made in the same week as i'm recording another video you'll be seeing that fair in the next week after the it, the week after this video comes out in that i will be getting my wisdom teeth pulled I'm not gonna actually show them like doing the surgery and stuff, but like, why is this mother Kong Island movie all up in my shot? I am getting my wisdom teeth pulled. And I want to try to record this video as soon as I can and like finish it up and edit it and get it ready because I'm not gonna be able to do it stuff for Saturday because I'll be talking weird, <laughs> and that's gonna be in like a few days. And other than that, I'm just I'm just really nervous because I never had to have surgery at any point in my life, so. This is very interesting. But yeah, um, yeah, be on the lookout for that. Yay! Yeah, without further ado, let's get into the unboxing. If I can open this. Oh, also next week, I'm also getting a very rare book. It's the hardcover run of the David Michelini Armor Wars. And I've been trying to collect a hardcover version of that story and trying to find one for so long. And I did. That's coming next week. Also, I am actually going to be documenting some of the time I am getting my was uh, like the process of when I'm getting my teeth pulled. Motherfucker! I know Markiplier already did something like that, but I just wanted to do it because it was just like, sounds fun. I'm going to be talking random stuff anyway. Good content. All for you guys. But I already talk enough and already tarnished my reputation already just by being myself on YouTube. But maybe this will actually make you laugh. All right, so all the tape is off. And I bought these two separately, but they came in the same package because they're both from the same seller. And that really makes me happy. And they really said they're in really good condition. And that makes me happy. Uh, yeah, and these are from Scott's Comics, not Scott Coffin. I don't want any rumors going around that Scott Coffin has his own comic shop and, and secretly is supplying me with comic books. I'm putting a stop to that right now. Secret that is actually not happening. I was just trying to make a bit out of that. Lunar distribution, also called wealth distribution. See, that's a joke about the economy. <laughs> Comedy. I'm gonna get sued or something by money. Ooh, and they're in like the slips of like the act, like you can actually have comic book with this. Receipt, there we go. Ooh, and these are both sealed. That makes me happy. Inspect before opening. No returns or exchanges if shrink wrapped is open. Purchase includes free digital copy on the Marvel Comics app. All right, that's good. There are no stickers so far. That's good. Oh, that is really epic. I love that. And I love this front cover. It is really amazing. And I also love the cover for Fantastic Four. It really does remind me of um, of Dan Slott's Fantastic Four cover uh, for hardcover book one. Yeah, it's clobbering time. God, I've been wanting to say that. Yeah, these both include like... A uh, the purchase includes a free digital copy on the Marvel Comics app, which I'm not going to use because I actually like holding the book. Yeah, let's uh, read the back of Spider-Man. All new original graphic novel modernizing the seminal origin and formative first days of this superhero icon that defined pop culture. Bookworm Peter Parker dreams of being famous like any high school student, but when a radioactive spider bite grants him amazing spider-like powers through a miracle of science, he learns that celebrity is a double-edged sword. And when a thief he arrogantly allows to go free later murders his beloved Uncle Ben, he learns an even more difficult lesson. With great power, there must also come great responsibility. You see, that's the thing with, like, Marvel Comics. Like, in the movie, you they do sometimes say, like, with great power comes great responsibility. But in the original comic, it's with great power, there must also come great responsibility. Like, and now let's uh, look at Fantastic Four. Make no mistakes, scientific genius Reed Richards thinks big. And when he launches the world's first privately funded rocket into space, he and his closest friends are in for the ride. 
their lives. Victims of a freak accident, Reed Richards, Susan Storm, Johnny Storm, and Ben Grimm will find themselves forever changed and, it, it, and inextricably linked. They will become a team, a family of adventures. But it's their courage and cataclysmic battles with Mole Man, the Submariner, and more that will make them heroes. I really am excited to read this. They're a really good science bait. They they are still a really good science based team. Same with Spider Man. And now we got the film for this one open. Oh, and it's not even and it doesn't even have a slipcase. It's literally just the book. That's pretty cool. Let's see the next one. All right, same. It's. It's just the book. That's pretty cool. And the binding in this one. Oh, I got a card. That's cool. I got a code where you can actually get the online version. Can, do I? Is, is it? Is it the same in the Fantastic Four one? It is. <laughs> it is. <laughs> oh God! I choked on my own spit. <laughs> I'm fine. Yeah, I got <laughs> code for the Marvel app. Yeah. Let's take a look at something. <laughs> The art inside. Oh, that's cool. That's very epic. It's a very like neat retro stuff. Oh, not really retro, but like it is very unique. It's very sleek and clean. <laughs> Prototype suit, Johnny Arachnid. That is so cool. It's so baggy. It reminds me of that like Jerry Seinfeld Halloween stitch where it's like he gets like a Superman costume and it's so baggy. And I assume when I put this costume on, I would probably look exactly like the Superman I had come to know on television and in the movies. You remember these costumes. It's not exactly the super fit. Yeah, but the art in this is amazing. And I, I know the origin of Spider-Man and the Fantastic Four, but I'm going to check the art inside. And um, yeah, it's the same. It's the exact same! It's the exact same in that one! I don't know why it's different for like Doctor Strange and the Iron Man one. Maybe it's different for Daredevil 2, but still, that is so cool! The art style, okay, I got, I'm gonna do my review right now. So, art, 10 out of 10. Sorry, I know them, like I know the origins. Ten, oh, 20 out of 10, actually, because they're such fantastic origins. Fantastic. And shipping, 11 out of 10, perfect condition, everything arrived exactly as intended so overall i gotta give it 100 out of 10 actually i'm really happy i i i'm not willing to do the math right now but that is really cool i really love it it is really cool anyway uh thank you everybody so much for watching i hope you've enjoyed please make sure to like comment share and subscribe tap the notification bell so you never miss a video from me and please subscribe to my friends their channels are in the description down below and please make sure to subscribe to me it really helps out the channel a lot and also if and also there is going to be my wisdom teeth documentary next next week and that's gonna be fun Motherfucker. hopefully yeah um thank you ever so much for watching and until next time i'll see you guys in the next video hey guys it's me tom Plex here back at you guys with another comic with it, not another comic book i'm actually in review but um this is the start to my documentation on my wisdom teeth removal and um it is currently about nine something or other and i have to fat and not fat I have to fast for about eight hours. So I gotta be eating as much food as I can before that eight hours starts and drinking as much as I can because I'm not gonna be eating or drinking anything for eight hours after that point. I'm actually really nervous. It's my first surgery, but um, yeah. Reason being is like my teeth are, as the professionals would say, fucked up. I'm gonna try to get this pulled because they're giving me quite the headache, but I'll see you guys soon, but until then, I got Tillamox cherry ice cream.
How you doing? You're the best. <laughs> Just to show you. Hello, everybody. Top of the morning. How are you guys? This is the mom. Look how sweet she is. She's the best mom in the world. Say hi to everybody. Hi, everybody. Now he'll check in later. Okay. My. I think I'm still high, but most of the drugs have worn off. But I feel like a Kardashian now. I'm the world's first male bimbo. All I have to do is, is fill my ass with everything stupid. My head is already empty anyway. That's a very rude thing to say, I'm sorry. Drugs. My lips are so numb. How much more of those drugs are on the counter? <laughs> They're good. <laughs> They're good, man. You got the good stuff. Well, we, you know, for you, it's only the best. Hey, we got steroids. I am strong. Hey, everybody. I, you may look closely and notice there's something a little bit different about me. I'm thick now. Like, my cheeks are so big. Big. Yeah, I'm no longer high with the pain meds, but everything still hurts like hell. But hopefully that's going to be going away in like a few days. But yeah, this has been my documentary about what happened. Makes great content to talk stupid, though I talk stupid a lot anyway. I am slowly on the mend and I'm doing a lot better. Yeah, thank you everybody so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tap the notification bell so you never miss a video from me. Please do subscribe to my friends. Their channels are in the description down below. And please do subscribe to me. It would really help out the channel a ton. Until next time, I will see all of you guys in the very next video where I'm going to get my nipples pierced. Nope, that's a lie. Bye.